What's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of Mind Something. If you're new here, my name is Jake and today I'm freaking stoked, man. I get to show you guys how to dual mine Ergo and Caspa on NVIDIA GPUs. I've been waiting on this one for a while and BZ Miner is the first one to release it. Keep in mind it is beta, but before I show you guys how to do this, I need you to do me a favor. I need you to hit that like and if you haven't already subscribed, I need you to subscribe. I got all day. Still haven't done it. Come on, man. We're wasting time. Okay, there you go. Good job. All right, moving on. So, first thing you need to do is you need to go to Windows, Settings, go to Update and Security. Then you're going to go to Windows Security, Virus and Threat Protection. And then you're going to go to Manage Settings under Virus and Threat Protection. And you're going to turn off Real-Time Protection. Now you might ask, why am I doing this? Leaves me vulnerable, right? Yeah, it does. But you just need to do this so that you can download the file because it's an EXE. And your computer is not going to let you do that until you disable real-time protection. So once you've done that, you're going to go to your browser. And you are going to go to GitHub. And I'll leave a link in the description below for you. Uh, but you're going to download version 11.0.2 and you'll notice right here I got it highlighted new dual ergo and caspa nvidia only scroll down to the bottom of the page and there you're going to see a windows version of the zip file now you notice I've already downloaded several but I'm going to download it one more time so you can see there is a little error message after you finish downloading it it's going to tell you that this file could be dangerous and it looks like the only option is to discard it. However, click the arrow and select keep. Once you do that, it will finish the download. And then you're going to go back to your file explorer. And you're going to go find the file in your download section. Notice I have a few of them here. I also created a folder. So once you have the zip file, you're going to right click it and you're going to extract the files there or wherever you prefer. Now, if you don't have WinRAR, I suggest downloading that. It makes this process of unzipping files a lot easier most times. But once you're done unzipping the file, it's going to look like this one here. Double click on it and you'll see Dual, Ergo, and Caspa. You're going to right click it and select Edit. It's going to pull it up in your notepad and here's where you're going to make some changes. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to select these zeros and replace that with your wallet address for Ergo. Make sure you keep the space in between the W and your wallet address. The next thing you're going to do is you're going to replace the stratum with the stratum to your pool. Now in my case I am using actually nano pool but I'm going to show you how to do it with Wooly Pulley because it's nice and easy to find. So if you go to Wooly Pulley you can select Ergo and then right here it says how to connect and all you got to do is select your region and it will copy that uh, stratum and you just simply go back here and you're going to replace all of that with your stratum uh, excuse me you will start from here let's double check that just to make sure I'm gonna pull up my existing bat file just so you guys can see exactly what it should look like so we got ergo dash W full wallet address dash P space stratum plus SSL now this may be different depending on your pool but you paste that whole thing in there. Next, you're going to replace the Caspa wallet with your wallet. So again, you're going to delete all of this. So you can start from Caspa dot and all the zeros because when you copy your Caspa address, the Caspa wallet address does include the word Caspa in it. So depending on where you copy and paste it from, would determine whether or not you highlight all of the word caspa or not then you're going to replace your stratum as well you can get that again from wooly pulley 
if I can minimize all these, we'll pull the browser back up. So same thing, go back to pools, go to Caspa, how to connect, and then copy your stratum there. Once you are done pasting that back into your bat file, you want to save this, but make sure you save it as a different name. So file, save as, I always save mine as a copy. That way I don't get confused with the other one. And then another very important step is make sure you change this where it says text document to all files. You'll notice the bat files appear then. Okay. So once you're done with that, all you've got to do is pull up the file, right click it and make sure you run as administrator. Hit yes. And there you go. You are off to the races. Now for the, those of you who did not hit the like button, you got another opportunity. Do it. Do it now. You didn't do it. I'm coming after you. All right, I'm kidding. I'm out, guys. Thanks.